It's been a long time, I know. We're gonna ignore it. Welcome to a day in my life. A lot has changed since the last time I've done a day in my life, or I think I did a week in my life video last, like my last kind of vlog style video. I originally wanted to do like a fall day in my life, but we'll see, that's gonna come later, I think. Today, it's gonna be a day in my life, like I've said a thousand fucking times. Why do I always do that? I just repeat the title over and over again. Anyway, my period started today, so I am feeling like absolute trash. I am in so much pain. I took some Tylenol, waiting for it to kick in, so we'll see. I have class at 12.30, I just have one class today, it's Thursday, and yeah, I don't have to leave my house until like 11.50, so I just thought I'd do a little intro here, we'll get ready together, we'll go to school together, and then we'll see, I was kind of planning on going to like Value Village or something after, but we'll see how I'm feeling. And then I'm going to the library to study with my sister tonight, so it's mainly just like a school day in my life, yeah. I'm really lucky because my earliest class is at 10 a.m., which is on Fridays, so almost every day I get to like, like I don't really sleep in, but every day I get to like relax in the mornings if I need to, or just do my homework and just like read and just kind of recharge, which I find is best for me, so yeah. And my cat's here. Okay, okay. Anyway, I'll see you soon. I'm out of the bathroom. I'm just gonna put braids in my hair because I showered yesterday and I just don't want to use heat on it the day after I showered because it just doesn't hold very well when it's like freshly washed and clean and everything so and braids are usually my go-to for school anyway so let's do it. The other day I did my hair in really cute like two little buns just like little low buns or whatever and I got to school and it was like weird there was like a fire alarm bell going off so I was like really confused I was like should I walk to my class or like stay outside because obviously I don't know about your college but mine we have not had a little introduction to fire drills or anything like that and so I just saw this random like employee that came out of the library and I was like hey like where are we supposed to go and then he showed me so I was just standing there and then I used like these tiny little elastics like these little rubber ones and it broke and my bun like came out and i was like fuck like my hair <laughs> like it's not that deep but my hair looked like this but it wasn't freshly washed it was like disgusting and needed to be brushed and like my hair just doesn't look good natural or anything like that so obviously it just it didn't look good so i was like fuck, like what am i gonna do so i went to take the other one out to just make my hair in one bun and that one broke too so i was like full-on panicking and this might be absolutely disgusting and I'm aware like it's gross I can't believe I did this but there was a hair elastic like a normal like ponytail or whatever you want to call them like the fabric-y ones on the ground outside the library I pretended I dropped it and picked it up and used it in my hair. I'm aware it's disgusting and it probably had COVID on it. I'm kidding. I know COVID doesn't really live on surfaces that long, but I'm aware it was like really disgusting. I used hand sanitizer right after I used it and I washed my hair that night, but like that was a really low moment for me. I really had to, I just sat in the next class and just thought, thought about it for a while. I was like, like really? Why? Like that's embarrassing and that's on the internet forever now, so don't judge me, I was having a rough day. Also, how cute is this sweater? I wish I had the kind of boobs that I didn't have to wear a bra every day. This is odd to talk about. I'm not showing them, what the fuck am I doing? Anyway, I always feel like I wanna go braless, but like in a loose shirt, I feel like my boobs just don't look right. So it's so annoying when I wanna be comfortable and not wear a bra, but I have to, I don't know. Anybody else feel me? Also, these are like the only black jeans I have right now um, that fit me, but they're like super tight on the waist, which is not gonna be fun today because I am in severe pain. Oh, they are a little tight. I think I just dried them. Okay, I gotta find a bra and then I'll catch up with you in a bit. Here's the fit. I changed the jeans because these are a lot looser on my stomach and I feel way better. <laughs> also, I don't know where you live, but like I have to wear masks to school and my grandma gave me this one. 
It's way comfier than normal masks, but I'm embarrassed to wear it because I look like a bird. So this is the perfume I'm wearing today, Lazy Sunday Morning by Mason Margiela, the replica brand. It's literally the best. I'm holding my camera weird. I love perfumes that almost smell like something your grandma would wear, so yeah. There's just something so sensual about it, you know? That was a weird word to use when I said grandma. Whatever, I'm gonna take some more Tylenol. Ugh. Okay, bye. I'm at school now. I'm just in the parking lot. I got here extra early because yesterday I couldn't find a parking spot even though I pay hundreds of dollars for a parking pass. So I was like, I should get here early. I got a spot. So now I'm just sitting here and it's really awkward because I don't want to see anyone from any of my classes seeing me film. But I'm so glad we have to wear masks to school because it literally covers up everything. So yeah, I'm gonna start walking in soon and I'll do a little montage of that. But then it's class time and I'll get a little like I sit alone in the back corner because I'm trying to be like mysterious and like not like other girls. Like I just want people to be like, who is she and why is she in the back corner? Um, I'm failing, but I'll be successful by the end of the semester. But there's like this writing on the wall. I'll blur out the phone number, but it's there's funny writing. It's not really that funny, but I'll get a picture of it or a video or something. So see you. <laughs> Wake up this morning Make the mistake of turning on the TV Nothing but bad news Empty ever news Rolling on the screen Oh Walk to the kitchen And make myself a, a cup of coffee Wave at the older man Get in a something tan On his balcony Oh yeah, we both have been stuck in our apartments for two months too long We don't even get along, but the world just fell apart uh, Straight out of the blue, so in my mind I whisper ciao And I take myself to Tuscany, Italy You probably can't hear me because I have the air conditioning blasting Because it's so goddamn hot, but I'm back in my car I couldn't film very much because it's really awkward to film at school I've realized, so Okay, well now I have to go to my grandma's house, so Catch you later The hardest part of the day is over. I'm now in bed, my safe space, and I'm gonna watch YouTube videos. So, I feel so ill. Okay, so my best friend Nina sent me a letter. We're like gonna be like pen pals or whatever because we've never met in person. She lives in the US and I live in Canada. And obviously with COVID, we can't meet, but yeah, I just got it and I'm gonna open it up. Oh my god. Oh my god. I don't even have any words. <laughs> Okay, so my sister and I decided we're not going to the library because I kind of feel like trash and she's really tired from work. So I am just reading my textbook and taking notes on it on my iPad. This was like the best purchase I've ever made. Um, It's great. And I got one of those like paper screen protectors. So I have my textbook and then notability so I can just take notes on it, which is like super fun and great. Yeah, so I'm just gonna be taking notes. I'll try to get a little montage of it. Park riding, or better yet, you know, I bet you're at home cooking. I wonder what you are wearing. A cable knit sweater you pair it with, corduroy slacks. Wait, I take that back. You might be more daring. I've been over every detail. So I know that there will come a day It could be snowing or I find myself caught in the rain I'll look into the crowd, so many 
faces, but a single one will stand out. Hearts skipping a beat, one, two, four, and three. Then suddenly call me crazy, but I think it might be the one for me. Am I being romantic or just unrealistic? If I believe in destiny and everyday magic. Is there a someone for no one? Okay, okay. Well, that was a day in my life. Now that I'm in school and life is a little different. I hope you enjoyed this video. Videos will be more consistent. I already have a video pre-filmed and a video like halfway pre-filmed. It's a big one, so it's a little bit difficult to measure just exactly how close I am to finishing, but I hope you liked this video and I hope everything's going great for you right now and I don't know, the fall is my favorite season, so I hope you're having a great almost fall. Only a few more days, so I'm super excited and have a great morning afternoon night whatever and i'll see you in my next one so thank you so much for watching and goodbye that was so awkward